At Abrishami Synagogue, a rabbi leads worshipers in prayer. Then a ceremony to celebrate the Jewish holiday of Sukkot. At Musa bin Imran School, the headmaster welcomes an all-Jewish student body. At Tapu Restaurant, patrons dig into kosher food. And at this intensive care unit, nurses tend to patients at a charity hospital founded and run by Jews. Sure, it may seem like we're in Israel. But in fact, we're in the Islamic Republic of Iran. Are you happy in Iran? Of course, we are happy in Iran. Siamak Morsadev is a Jewish lawmaker in Iran's parliament. In his office, Moses on one wall, Iran's supreme leader on the other. Are you under any pressure to stay in Iran? Mm, there is no specific pressure for the Iranian Jew. Would you prefer to live anywhere else other than Iran? I only prefer to live in Iran. If you're not familiar with Middle Eastern history, you may be surprised to learn roughly 10 to 20,000 Jews live in Iran, according to the Jewish community. Most of them born and raised here. Jews have lived in modern day Iran dating back to 6th century BC, when Persia's King Cyrus released Jews from Babylonian captivity. Some estimates show Iran has the second largest Jewish population in the Middle East outside of Israel. Their numbers have declined over the years, mostly because of migration. Those that remain say they face no discrimination from the majority here. Here they show a lot of respect for Judaism, says Shahnaz Rehanian. It's better than many other places. Everyone here, the Muslims and the Jews, live and work together, says Zarif Setare Shenas. This despite the Iranian government's bitter rivalry with the Jewish state of Israel. Unfortunately, many of the media in Western countries broadcasting some news about Iran, which is much far from the reality. More said that rejects allegations that Iran and its government are enemies of Jews. In the history of Iran, you cannot find even one uh, time that there was organized anti-Semitic phenomenon. More said that says what Iran opposes is the Israeli government's Zionist policies and occupation of Palestinian land. There is a great difference between being a Jew and being a pro-Israeli or Zionist. I think that the behavior of Israeli regime is not in the direction of uh, Torah and Talmud teachings. Iranian law says it's illegal for citizens to travel to Israel and come back. But community leaders say the law has yet to be enforced. Some Jews here say they've traveled to Israel, but home remains Iran. Reza Sayyid, CNN, Tehran.